Happy Tuesday, everyone. Back with Rocket League again. Back on Tuesday. Instead of Thursday, like it was last week, because, uh... Who did we play last week? Francis Howell had to take... Couldn't play that Tuesday, but back to our normal Tuesday schedule. This week we were playing Francis House Central once again. Alright. Mr. Zaffy's with the clear down the field and a pass. Missed by Zaffy's. Magic miss clearing it down the field. Crosshair stopping it midfield. Ethan making it to the ball but just bouncing it off of shield. Crosshairs off of that bottom corner of the wall. Mr. Zaffy's through the air. The nice shot towards their goal, and that will be a, the first goal for Lindbergh. With almost a minute elapsed in this first game. Just a reminder to everyone that it's a series of five. Best of five, just like always. So first team to three wins, wins. Mr. Zappi's hitting the ball to the Francis Howell side of the field. Straight to crosshairs. We'll take it up the wall. Being bumped by shield. Ethan Ovi will get a demo on Magic Miss. That was saved by Tyler Toad. But another goal by Mr. Zappi's with an assist by Ethan MLB. Oh, that was actually a goal by Ethan. But... Snagged by Mr. Zappies at the end. Hey, I just read what the board says. Oh my gosh, right off of the kickoff by Crosshairs. Straight down to the Francis House Central side of the field. Winning an instant goal for Lindbergh. Straight down the side of the field. Magic Myth will go for the ball, but will miss. Tyler Code will hit it towards Lindbergh's goal, but a save by Mr. Zappies. Who will send it above Lindbergh's goal, and then proceed to clear it down the field, past Shield. Over Shield, centering the ball, and, uh, centering the ball and being followed up by Ethan MLB. Scoring a fourth goal for Lindbergh. With 3 minutes and 37 seconds left still in this first game. That's a cool looking car. Mr. Zappy's hitting the ball to Francis Howell side of the field. Ethan will be will hit that ball straight up, pinching it off of Tyler. Crosshairs with the crosshair with that tap down the field. Aerial by crosshair straight toward the goal. Saved by shield. Ethan attempted to follow that up. Off the sidebar by Mr. Zappies, but he will follow up with his own from his own hit, sending it right over the Francis Howell defender and scoring a goal. Francis Howell gained the ball down to Lindbergh's side of the field, but Ethan will be sending it over their players and getting it all the way back, clearing it down to Francis Howell's side of the field. Shield getting it away from his team's goal, but the ball will still end up on their side of the field. Magic Mist hoping to make some momentum for his team, but Limburg keeping it down on the Francis Howell side of the field. Ball almost doing a slow roll in, but being saved by Shield again. Off of Crosshair with a pinch off of Francis Howell will be sent up the wall. Ethan MLB with that pass straight to Mr. Zappi who will score a 6 goal. A demo right off the bat by Mr. Zappi's on the Magic Mist. Down the field, the ball will be centered above Lindbergh's goal. Cleared away by Ethan MLB. Ethan MLB with no boost isn't able to make it up with the ball. But Crosshairs follows that up. Almost centering the ball in the middle. It'll be sent back to the center with Mr. Zappi's will follow up. With that two touch aerial. Centering the ball right in the middle. But Francis Howell will take it back down to Lindbergh's side of the field. Hit by Ethan MLB. 
follow up in the air. And getting away from shield who took it from him. Mr. Zappi is almost scoring a goal, but simply setting the ball up for a goal by Ethan MLB. Score of this game with just less than two minutes left, or just over three minutes elapsed, is seven to zero. Right off the bat, the, the ball gets pinched onto Limburg's side of the field, being centered. Francis Howell will hope to make some momentum from this and score their first, the team's first goal of the game. Magic Miss flipping in the air away from the ball. Tyler Coates following up the defense MLB, sending the ball up in the air and being followed up by Mr. Sappy, who will get all the way back down to the France house side of the field once again, as we've seen for most of this game so far. Up the wall to the right of Limburg's goal. And sending it over, almost over all the Francis Howell players. But we back down in the front south side of the field. Demo by Shields onto Ethan MLB. Mr. Zappies with that aerial touch from that corner of the field, from that left corner of Francis Howe's goal. Scoring the eighth goal for his team. Off of the lower wall with a flip into the ball, into that far side of that, to that far right side of the goal. Shields will send the ball down to Limburg side of the field, but will, will be blown over by Mr. Zappies. We'll follow up, almost scoring another goal for his team. Limburg hoped to, was hoping to make some momentum there and score another one, even though they don't really need to. Center by Crosshair. And a complete whiff by Mr. Zappies. Ethan will be getting the ball off of the trajectory of making it into the goal. Bouncing it off of the backboard, Mr. Zappies will now take it back down the field. Centering it off of the left side of the goal. It will now end up back down to Limburg side of the field. 30 seconds remain in this... Well, it's not really exhilarating if it's uh, playing out like this. High scoring, that's the word I'm looking for. In this high scoring game for one team. That set up... That... That... <laughs> That smooth, that triple, triple play action from Ethan to Mr. Zappies, and that follow up by Crosshairs. Score, all three players getting to touch the ball for that, to assist with that goal. Right off of kickoff, another goal by Mr. Zappies, bringing it 10-0. This game hitting the double digits for one team. That sideways slide. Oh, that's something entertaining to watch for me. And pretty, pretty easy for me too. Nine seconds left. Not much, not much can happen here. Limburg will be going into game two up 1-0. Putting them ahead. Limburg keeping the ball in the air. Still not hitting the ground off of the wall. It'll finally... <laughs> Limburg. Spelled wrong. Alright, once everyone readies up, we'll be going into game two. Two of five. Ten O. -oh. That I think if I I'm pretty sure that is our highest scoring game of uh of the year so far. And Francis Howell will be subbing out a player. Not sure which player that will be. Looking like it will be, who's the other one? I was like Mystic Wind or something like that. Anyway, we now have craziness on the field for Francis Howe Central. Will that be enough for them to turn the tides of this game? Straight down the middle of the field, off of kickoff. A bump on Ethan MLB by craziness. He'll take the ball, trying to get it over Mr. Zappi. Mr. Zappi will send it 
overall Francis Health player scoring the first goal with 10 seconds elapsed in this game. Off of that, off of that left sidebar. Mr. Zappi pinching the ball off of that kickoff off of the backboard by Ethan MLB. Up in the middle. And another goal by Mr. Zappi. <laughs> 18 seconds down. Two goals in for Lindbergh. Maybe it's the opponents or maybe it's the team, but they are playing much more. There's just a much more. There's just a much better sense of coordination among the team today. Mr. Zappies. Sending to that right side of Francis Hall Central's goal. They will hope to clear it down the field, but Mr. Zappies sending almost over two players. The ball will be left in that left or that right corner of the their goal. Tyler hoping to clear it downfield. Mr. Zappi's blowing over Ethan MLB. Crosshair's now hoping to follow up the center. Off of the ceiling by Mr. Zappi's. A missed hit by Tyler Toads. Shields will not get down the field. Craziness in the... Dang, he's got the wagon wheels on. Mr. Zappi's. The leg, the leggy bounce down the field. Tyler Toads with the aerial. Demo by Crosshair onto Shield who is sitting in the Francis Tile goal. Mr. Zappi's sending in an aerial but being bounced away by Crazy. Ethan MLB taking it across Lumber's goal in a dang, scary move. Right to the right of Lumber's goal by Crazy in a follow up by Tyler Coates, but it'll be saved by Crosshair, who's luckily in the goal to save that. Mr. Zappi's bouncing it over two of the Francis South Central players. The ball will now be sent down the wall. Flying, flying diagonally across Francis Howell's goal. Ethan MLB will get it back down there, centering the ball. And a miss, a miss save by, uh, I think that was Tyler Coase. I need to get better at uh, recognizing the name. Craziness driving backwards for a second, being crazy. Off of the backboard by Crosshair. That light tap by Mr. Zappi is arcing the ball. Straight to Crosshairs, who will hope to score a goal, but will just bounce it off of that top, like right or the top left. Hey, I'm so bad at directions today. Top left corner of the uh, Francis Howe goal. Mr. Zappi's with that follow-up, bouncing it straight across their goal, up off the wall by Ethan MLB. He will fly off the ceiling with no boost. Crosshairs. Sending the ball over Tyler Coates. Mr. Zappi's getting it away from Francis Howell. Centering the ball. Both Ethan and Crosshair will miss. Craziness hoping to take it. Craziness scoring the first goal for his team in this series. Completely breaking away from all of the Lindbergh players. In his, I think that's the grog. In the grog with the wagon wheels. Interesting card choice. A bounce off of the ceiling. And a clear downfield by Mr. Zappi, who will uh, hope to follow it up with an aerial, but instead Ethan MLB will take over with that. Bouncing it off of that top, I'm going to say it right this time, top right left crossbar corner of Francis House Central's goal. Right down to the middle of the field, Mr. Zappi will come down from the ceiling, off of the wall, bouncing it again diagonally across, crosshair. Now with the right angle to make it in, it will bounce, it will continue to bounce into the center field down by Francis House Central's side of the field. A bounce towards the goal by Lindbergh. Lindbergh keeping it down on this side of the field. Off of the wall by Tyler Coates. Follow up aerial by Ethan MLB. Straight to Mr. Zappi's. Who once again just sent it. Send, send the ball down to the center of the field. Francis Howe hoping to get it back down to Lindbergh's side of the field. A series of demos demolishing two of Lindbergh's players. Crosshairs off of the wall, down to the ground. Shields will send it away. Followed up by Ethan MLB going for that aerial goal, but being beaten to the ball by Crazy, who will knock it away. Ball being 
kind of nulled out from multiple hits by people right there. Craziness. Hitting a kind of awkward angle. Mr. Zappy sending it over. Uber Francis Hell Shield will hope to block that from making it into his team's goal, but he was unable to. The score is now 3-1 with 30 seconds left. Francis Howell need to start playing a lot, a lot more aggressive and getting the ball down to Lindbergh's side of the field if they will want to win this uh, this game, game two of the series. Off of craziness, we'll send it down the field, but Mr. Zappi is there blocking at midfield. Hoping to do some light air dribble down the field, but it's unable to. Crazy sending it down the field again, hoping to score the second two, two of two goals for his team, but unable to. The ball down Limburg side of the field. Being cleared away by Mr. Zappi. The ball will hit the ground, and Limburg, Limburg will win game two. Now leading the series 2-0 to zero against Francis Howell Central. Game two. Just a reminder for anyone who either didn't hear or just tuned in late. It's just once again a game. Or a uh, best of five series. Lindbergh is up two to zero. Going into game three. All right, going into game three, game three. This craziness still using the wagon wheels. I did not know there was wagon wheels for your car and <laughs> wagon spokes. You know, I'm not gonna Right off the bat, Lindbergh getting it down to Francis Howell's side of the field. Ball being sent off of the backboard. Mr. Zappi's with that follow up off of the top crossbar. Shot on goal, but not making it in. Over crosshair, followed up by a demo on crosshair. Craziness almost scoring a goal for his team, but being slightly too far to the right on the breaks goal. The ball will now be cleared and end up back down Francis Howe's side of the field. Francis Howe with a lot more momentum this game, actually keeping it down on the break side of the field a little bit. Craziness flipping around in that beetle of a car. Mr. Zappi's. Off of that right, left corner, oh, almost said right there, left corner of Francis House Central's goal. Up the wall by Ethan MLB. Slowly hitting the ball down to the center of the field, off of crosshair, but shield is in the way. Preventing a ball from slowly rolling into the goal for Lindbergh. Ethan MLB hoping to take it up the wall, but being demoed by Tyler Code. Crosshairs with that follow-up, getting points for a shot on goal. Shields getting points for defending it. Almost making a goal off that top right corner by Mr. Zappies, but unable to. As it is hit, knocked off the crossbar. Ball now being sent up the wall by Mr. Zappies and off of the ceiling. It'll be bounced at a 90 degree angle, it looks like, off of that side wall. Um, so that's so nice, <laughs> that was so dumb. The ball just sitting in Limburg's side of the field. Off of the ceiling, right in front. Ethan will be hitting it away and Crosshair's clearing it back down to Francis House Central side of the field. A miss by Shield. And a shot on goal by Mr. Zappies from half field. It will make it in, scoring the first goal of the game. With three minutes and three seconds left of game three. Lots of threes in that sentence I just said. Shields sending it down to the left side of Lindbergh's field. Up and off the wall by Mr. Zappies. Away from Crazy who was hoping to beat beat him to it. 
an air, a second follow-up shot on ground by Mr. Zappy, scoring the second goal relatively quickly right off of, not right off a of kickoff, but relatively quickly after kickoff. The wagon wheels! Crosshair bouncing the ball off a of shield, who will get it down to Limber's side of the field. Mr. Zappy taking control of the ball. Ah, I was in the wrong camera mode. I thought that looked weird. If I switch between them. Nah, that's not it. Ethan then will be up and off of the top corner of that wall. Almost at the ceiling. Bounced by Mr. Zappy. Bouncing it over. Over Francis House Central's players. And knocking it off of the crossbar. Into the goal. With that nice little follow up. They're off again. Craziness stopping the ball from being flown down to the side of the field, but Crosshair will take it up the wall over their players. Craziness will be demoed, and Ethan will be great setup by Crosshair, and a great shot on goal and goal by Ethan MLB. One. Four goals down, all for Limbert. The ball will be soaring down along the ceiling to the right side of Francis House Central's goal. Off of the left, or off of the right. Mm, man, I'm. I think I mixed up my right and left. Off of the backboard, almost the follow up by crosshair. Mr. Zappies. Off of the crossbar at the top. Down the field by Ethan OB. It'll be, it'll be saved by Mr. Zappies. Who will knock it away? Up and off the wall. He will keep it close to the wall as he takes it back down to, to the Francis Hall Central side of the field. Straight off of the corner and down the field. Ethan and Wolby will block that shot from crazy. The ball in center field. Ethan and Wolby will take it, but it'll be knocked away by Shield and followed up by Crosshair for Limburg. Craziness once again getting it away from the Limburg defense. Ooh, series of bounces by Limburg getting the ball away from their goal. But this is the, probably the longest and closest we've seen the ball to Limburg's goal in all of the games so far. With finally a clear downfield by Limburg. And that in that tap in air by Ethan MLB. With a great follow up by Crosshair. And that set up by Ethan MLB. That'll be the fifth goal for Limburg. Making today look like it will definitely probably be a clean sweep of Francis Howe Central for Limburg. Straight off of the ceiling. And a big clear down the field by Mr. Zappies. Tyler Code will hope to get it back down the field for his team. But to no avail. Craziness sending it over Mr. Zappies. Centering the ball, Tyler Code will score the second goal for his team in this entire series. First one for his team this game. Into that little bottom corner of Lumber's goal. Crosshair's missing the kickoff. The ball being slightly off center from Limburg's goal. Missed aerials from Limburg. This is looking like when I play ranked. Straight down the field and by Ethan LV followed by Crosshair. It will roll into the field as no one from no one from Francis House Central is able to make it to it. Six to one. The one with 23 seconds left. Crosshairs with that back flip off <laughs> for kickoff. Ball centered by Shields and knocked in by Tyler Codes. They will score two this game. But I think it's pretty safe to call that this series and the matches they will be won by Limburg. As they are keeping a healthy score difference over France House Central this game. <laughs> a second a second to go. And, and that will be the end of the games for today. 
Bloomberg winning the series 3 0. Let me save that replay real quick. Game 3. A nice change of pace from last week's loss to Farmington. A clean sweep 3 0 today against Francis House Central. Thank you guys for watching the stream once again. We'll be back next Tuesday with another standard league match. Limerick's overall record is now, th um, I'm trying to think, 4-1 to one, I think. But I'll double check that for next week. We're getting close to the point of guaranteed finals, but it's not guaranteed yet. But thank you everyone for watching.